y'all it's me my loser harvey welcome to my channel if it's not your first time watching welcome back i know i said on the last vlog it was like mlk weekend i said every other week and then january started swinging on me and i had to take a little break i have a lot going on which we'll get into later but i'm outside of city of ink in atlanta I'm about to go get another tattoo i'm in the process of finishing my sleeve so i'm here again today i literally just like choke down my food before I go to my tattoo from Gusto. If you live near Gusto, go there, get the sweet soy sriracha, half and half bowl, and just thank me later. You're welcome. Um, But yeah, so hopefully this tattoo doesn't take too long. I have no idea what I'm getting today. I'm going to Justin now. I think this will be my fourth or fifth time, and I'm just going to trust him, and we're going to figure it out in the appointment. Um, Normally, I know exactly what I'm getting. I have I don't know today. I just know where it's going on my arm. But we'll see. I'm excited either way. That Gusto literally has me like sweating. Um, the first thing he always asks me is, did you eat today? Normally my answer is no. And I will have like an Uncrustable in my bag or something. So I really wanted to make sure that I ate before this appointment because I know he's going to ask me that. But let me go ahead and get out the car. Um, and get in here. If you know Peter Street in Atlanta... I gotta get up out of here and take all my stuff with me, so let's go to the tattoo shop. This is Justin, my tattoo artist. <laughs> um, I don't know, what do you think? I don't know how subtle you're trying to be, like do you want like a piece to your doggy? Um, I was gonna just get the paw, I don't know why I put my jacket back on. Okay. I was gonna just get the paw here eventually. Mm -hmm. So I don't think it needs it then. You don't do that. But I feel like, yeah, I don't need it. I'll, I really want to get one for her though. <laughs> you want it in her? I feel like I want to get one for her. Yeah. Where did Taffy come from? I was thinking like Laffy Taffy. You know what? I have no idea. I got her, and I was like, I'm just gonna let her tell me where her name is. I don't know where Taffy came from. Okay. It just felt like her name. That would go, that would fill up this spot and then you would just have like. I know, I'm trying not to obsess over every little spot being <laughs> empty. That's the main large spot. Well, I think that was, that was, that was, what do you think? Do you think I should do the paw separate? Is the paw dumb in the flowers? You can tell me it's dumb in the flowers. I was gonna do it, it's gonna be super subtle. Like you won't notice it unless you like it. Which is fine, it. I'm fine with that. I can do that. I'm gonna do it separate. Yeah, but Taffy, I, yeah. Cause I want her name on it, so I'm gonna do it. Separate. Okay, that's a, another thing. I was gonna yeah. Do you want her name on it? Well, but that's what I'm saying. If we just do the paw like I sent, then I could just do that here. Yeah. And not even worry about it. I see. What's the last one I did? The last one you did was the vase. How did that heal up? Really good. Ooh, nice. It like barely peeled. Yeah, that's why. I, like I was it. wondering if I did something wrong. No, nah, that's perfect. Yeah, okay, good job. Yeah, yeah. nice job here. Really Take good. care of it. Any leaf, yeah. Any leaf you think would work. Or if you're like, it really fits better with the cattails, then we'll keep the cattails. One of these might maybe could work. Like, I don't like that one. Okay, I like that. Okay, okay give me My tattoo I am so obsessed and so in love with it um, like I said I didn't know what I was getting but I trusted Justin I was actually supposed to get a second tattoo yesterday um, right here for Taffy but we ended up not being obsessed with the placement um, of that one so we both know how indecisive I am so we decided let's wait the tattoo shops not going anywhere I'm not going anywhere we can get it later so there's that but I'm very excited. I have um, been wanting to finish my sleeve for a while. I decided to very aggressively um, work on my sleeve that I started. I got my first tattoo on this arm when I was like 17, maybe 16, and I knew I wanted a sleeve, but in the last like six months, 
or so, I decided like, I really wanna get this finished and get this filled. So this was the biggest spot that was left. Um, hopefully, the, I just like grease it up. Hopefully it's not reflecting too much, you can kind of see. But Justin did this one last month. Uh, the month before that, he did my one with the flower head. And then I just have some other floral and like nature ones on this arm. So I'm really, really excited. I got out a little bit later yesterday and then I cleaned it and everything like that. Um, so as you guys can see, well, if you've seen my vlog before, you know, I am at my sister's house. Um, me and my little fully packed car and Taffy got on the road very early this morning and prepared because I am moving. If, you know what, I haven't told anybody, so outside of my immediate friends, if you are watching this vlog, you are one of the first people to know. Um, but I'm really, really excited. Y'all have moved with me more than once. Um, Y'all know when I moved into my current apartment, I had a nightmare moving because it was just a hot mess. It was under duress, all that kind of stuff. But I'm very excited. I've been like Facebook marketplace shopping, all that kind of crazy stuff. So that's a whole nother, I feel like I need to do like a chit chat, get ready with me, just talking about all the moving and stuff like that. But I'm super excited. The good thing is that I will be moving into a home. So I am slowly moving things kind of more to my leisure versus we are an apartment. It's like, I gotta be out of this part by this time. I gotta go to the leasing office, get to this part by this time. I get to kind of like slowly move until I do the big move. So that is what I'm doing this trip, just kind of slowly bringing things up and also, um, doing like a little auntie niece weekend with my niece. So I'm excited. I started very early. I have some like, the main thing I'm focusing on this weekend is bathroom renovation. So I'm waiting for my sister and then I need to go to like Home Depot and stuff. But I'm, I know I said I'm excited like 10 times, but I am. This and then the house and then spending a week with my niece. Like this is, this week, this is gonna be a vlog of joy. And that's very exciting for me, so. Let's go do some stuff. This is b -roll. Hey, Tater, look. Look at your Valentine's Day stuff. Ooh! Ah! I know I was Are you excited? Socks. Yay, new you stuff. You me for a new cup because we still using our Santa Claus cup. Are you excited for your for your gifts? Yes, sir. Can you show me excitement? Normally, you're so animated. Can you, <laughs> hey, can you act excited, please? You know how we do. This is like Daddy in Blue. Oh, get, you better get, 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 get used to it. I gotta say, I thought the brownies was gonna be the star of the show. You don't see the brownies? And they're heart shaped. Now look, Taffy tried to try to get in on our, our thing. So Taffy tried look, to open this box. Taffy tried to eat your brownies. Taffy tried to eat your brownies. <laughs> That's why it's ripped like that. I had to fight her, fight her for it. <sighs> it looks so crazy in here right now. I've been almost using this like a storage unit. But I have the vision and I see the vision. I'm excited to execute the vision. My mom is coming this weekend. I mean, she's coming today. I wanna go ahead and just start like, get my candles lit. We're just doing construction stuff today. I mean, this week, today and this week, but I just wanna start like getting it together. I've been Pinteresting so hard um, we went to Walmart and I got these smart light bulbs. I want all the light bulbs in the house to, I might be gonna do a tour because I want to be like the full vision of everything, but I got some smart light bulbs because I want every house, every light bulb in the house to be smart so I can like, Alexa, make the bathroom blue or whatever. So that is definitely something I want. And then just got this little matte Soap dispenser because, like I said, we're getting the bathroom together. So many random little things. I bought, I almost need to do inventory of what I have. I wonder if my sister's gonna be down here. <sighs> Let's see exactly what I have. I almost, I bought so much stuff, I low key forgot what I have. I'm gonna just lay it all out. Okay, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. The vibe is going to be like boho glam greenery kind of deal. I got these kitchen rugs at home, had a really good sale. So I got these rugs for my kitchen. Lots of black and white, but without feeling heavy. Black, white, and greenery and wood is kind of the deal. 
obsessed. I got this from West Elm and I'm kind of obsessed with it. It's this gold, it's a vase, but I can also put like candles in it. I can put flowers in it. I'm still trying to decide exactly what I'm gonna put in. I think, I'm thinking these pillowcases from Ikea are gonna be on the couch. I kind of just want to lay it all out so my mom can see it too, to kind of get what I'm giving. This is actual wallpaper for the bathroom. So y'all will see us put this wallpaper up. I'm doing a lot of stuff with um, contact paper. So this Drew Barrymore microwave. Um, I got this off Facebook Marketplace actually. Like I said, I've been living on Facebook Marketplace but it was half the price that it was on Amazon, Walmart, any of that. I was kind of shook because my claims are not the price they were when I went to college. <laughs> so I was like, oh, I'm not just gonna get a little, my claims aren't just like, I don't know, $30 or something. What else? I have so much random little stuff. I low-key need to be, I need to kind of build some stuff so I need to focus on that. Hopefully my sideboard and stuff that I need to build. This is the light for my bathroom. Oh yeah. My mom got me this shower phone holder um, because I am notorious for having to yell at Siri to change the song. So I'm actually really excited about that. Okay, I have a good bit of stuff. What's this? Oh, I forgot I bought these. Obsessed with these champagne flutes. Oh. These are gonna be so, oh, this is gonna be so good. I can visualize. These are gonna be so good. I almost wanna put them in a cabinet so they don't get messed up anywhere, especially because they are like delicate glass. I probably need to do the same with that. These, those are a good compliment. This turned into a house decor haul that I didn't really expect to. Um, these, my friend Felicia got me these martini glasses. I'm really liking, there were some viral, viral wine glasses um, on like Twitter and stuff. And I really loved the aesthetic. So I wanted some brown or similar glasses. So these will definitely serve that purpose. Some of this stuff I'm gonna have to put together. A lot of this stuff I'm gonna put together. Yeah. So this is my glasses organizer. It is cold in here. I'm definitely gonna turn the key on because right now, no way I'm working in here. No way I'm working in here. It is. I'm gonna wrap this up more. My sister got me a shower thing too. I need to see if maybe they want one or what else I can do with it. Okay, greenery. I think this is the jewelry case. Okay. I'm excited. I feel like the bathroom is going to transform very easily. I have my curtain rods and stuff. I'm gonna have to hang all my curtains. I brought all my curtains with me. So once we get like the curtains, little stuff like that, really I'll just be putting the big furniture in. I'm talking stream of consciousness. Just, I'm telling y'all to tell myself because I'm just trying to see it all together in my mind. Oh, who gets to get like a preview of their house before they move? So I'm excited because it's not a traditional slowly moving in like an apartment. I mean, fast moving in like an apartment. So yeah, hopefully my mom will be here soon. Oh, the cabinet paper. That's what I need to do. I need to see if I like, I'm gonna redo the cabinet in the bathroom. I've been watching on YouTube all the like DIY, bathroom stuff. I'm just trying to see how I can do stuff on my own. And also like not, it's a house so I can do permanent stuff, but permanent wallpaper and stuff like that is a lot. Okay. Okay, yeah. So it'll be like a white marbly kind of countertop. This is gonna be good. I'm so excited. My mama couldn't keep still, started painting. Where's my stuff? 
Where's what stuff? All the stuff. So I can paint too. What you paint? This wall. We can knock it, the room out faster if we both doing it. Okay. Um, I'm doing the well. You can do the detail around the like around the a door. I'll do whatever I need to do. Uh, I don't know what you want. I got gloves out there. We want gloves. Where's the? Oh. No, 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 just tell me. It's all open outside. Oh, okay. Uh, Keep the wallet in my shorty bag. You know she wants a mom when she tattooed her. as is is going to look very different by the time we're done i just want to show y'all right now we're about to completely overhaul this so first thing we have to do in here is strip the whole bathroom so i'm going to take all the shelves down outlets off the mirror off the wall uh, curtain down literally everything because we are redoing all the surfaces so we're going to paint the wall um wallpaper one wall this is a counter that we're going to contact paper we're adding handles to the cabinets um my mom is really handy i'm pretty handy but this is the first time for us doing a few of these things especially with the contact paper so youtube university is going to help us out and we're just going to trial and error at this point. Alright, kind of keep everything together. I'm actually thinking about I might even spray paint those to be matte black. Also we'll see. We'll see. Spray just a minute. I think I'm gonna put these shelves back exactly where they were, so I don't even have to do new stuff in the wall. Actually, y'all would not believe the series of events since our last vlog in the last like 12 hours. Taffy got lost overnight. Um, like literally didn't know where she was overnight. Um, we have her back now. But in the meantime, I had a panic attack. I think I have gotten a stomach bug and I'm like sick. I am just not feeling well at all. I just got up from laying down off the couch. I really want to just lay down and rest, but I feel like there's so much to do. Um, we've just kind of like plastered the walls and stuff in here. My mom has still been diligently working, but um in that place where like my brain is like come on we got work to do we got stuff to do but my body is like girl no you don't but i'm gonna try to push through i know my mom is about to fuss but i gotta get this renovation and stuff done and honestly because i don't feel well and there's so much to do i feel like i can't even like nap properly so i'm gonna just try to knock out as much as i can at least in the bathroom I feel like everybody knows bathroom and kitchen are most important. So getting the bathroom done is very like priority to me. I even text any work stuff or clients I have. Like I need a mental health day today. I'm just fighting for my life. <laughs> In my head I was like, dang, I didn't walk any of that. But I was literally like hyperventilating. It's a lot child, especially with Taffy going missing. Just when I was like, Today is so rough, it can't get any worse. She gonna miss him. Amidst my stomach bug yesterday, we did get the sideboard built. So there'll be two of these underneath my TV. So I can have some storage and stuff like that. I actually got this off of Facebook Marketplace. This is all stuff that's gonna go, but we built that yesterday and hopefully today we'll finish the bathroom. This 
will be, I don't know if I'm put it at the foot of my bed and put clothes in it or put it somewhere out there and put like all my linens and towels in it or something. I don't know. Mm. All I know is I need more storage, so. <laughs> yeah, it'll be good. We just gonna get more storage. And me asked for my um, housewarm registry. I said, you know I got one. <laughs> Half my problem be I, I just, you see how yesterday, if I thought about it, I bought it. Oh gosh. I mean, cause Amazon, I'm like, oh good, I can have it here. Half the stuff come today. Toilet paper holder, toilet base cover. Uh, something else comes today. Really wish. I really wish that uh, my cabinet came today. Oh, <laughs> I just like to see everything together. Oh. Okay, since it's two of us, instead of me having to measure and cut it, I can start from the top. Okay. And then I'll have you cut it at the bottom. Okay. Uh, so we just have the right length. Okay. How's that feel? I feel like I'm gonna need another one. Is that the only roll? I don't know. You bought it. Oh yeah, I'm gonna have to get another roll. If you want to do the whole wall. Yeah, yeah. Amazon will be here, have it here tomorrow. So I'm gonna need, I'm gonna need. now I hate that I wasn't able to vlog like doing the renovation as much as I wanted to but now I gotta go on auntie mode because it's that time so oh my battery is lying definitely gonna need a new battery we're strongly shifting gears because it is annual can can tater weekend so I'm in auntie mode now so I got a lot of stuff um, downstairs I was trying to say my last clip for my battery died got a lot of stuff delivered um, I just even bought two more nightstands off of Facebook Marketplace, but I'm going to have to pause on that. I'm already thinking about when I'm going to come back because I got to finish painting. The taffy and the wallpaper and all that, I mean, in the being sick and all that really threw me off my timeline, so I didn't finish a lot of the stuff that I wanted to finish. Uh, so I will be back sooner than later because I got to get that bathroom done and I'm really just ready to get all that stuff out the way. But for now, we gotta make a snack. So, let's make a snack. I am, let me go my last nap and see what it's saying, my last, how far I've made it. I did dry January. Oh, look at that. I am, it's not gonna show, but I am 39 days since I last drank alcohol. I'm not gonna hold y'all. I think it's gonna end this weekend. I already feel like I need a glass of wine just for, from pickup. Okay, snack. Blue, you didn't eat any of your apples or carrots? No. Okay. I was too full. Okay. You want a snack now? Yeah. No? Yes. Okay. Taffy, you okay? Kids be living life. Just like to pick me up, make my food, do my laundry. The problem is, um, eating like a toddler too. I don't know how much four year old eat. What? Are you talking about me? I'm making a snack. I'm vlogging. Vlogging? Mm-hmm. You know how your dad be having a camera? Yeah. I got my camera this weekend. So I can capture all the fun stuff we do. You were in my last vlog when we were in the mountains at the cabin.
even though you always that camera shot when I turn my camera on. You doing your yoga? This is a vlog of chaos. I had so many organized plans and things. I think I'm still gonna get some real content, but chaos. <laughs> Even the angles, chaos. The girls be doing the, the very cinematic vlogs and things. I don't understand. I'm, you know, I said when I did this though, some episodes would be long, some would be short, some would be organized, some would be chaotic. So we gotta have a little balance. Okay, madam, at your service with some snackies. <sighs> it just feels right. We're having pizza. It's Pookie in New Jack City when he tried to like throw the cookie. <laughs> oh my God, you should make a real like, when you just keep calling me. Up. You should make a real like peeking through it. Please, can you please do that? That would be hilarious. Okay. That would be hilarious. Like. It'd be like just the wine glass, and it's just like you peeking through, or like you around the corner. You just start like around the corner first, and then you're just like slowly getting closer. So. Uh -oh. Wait, hold on. Are you trying to break into our hotel? Yo, guys, don't worry about it. It was a big misunderstanding, right, Tom? Are you laughing at me? Now I'm sure you know what I do to cats that laugh at me. Come on, Mo, preach. Now what? I was about to. If you would shut that grill, let me handle this. My bad, huh? So are you gonna answer me? Ah. We made it through the night, barely. She slept longer than me. She ended up waking me up, telling me, like, okay, I'm sleepy now. Um, and woke up at the same time. Now I gotta get breakfast ready. I'm having a big, um, A single mom who works two jobs, loves her kids, and never stops. That's how I feel. I'm a survivor. That's exactly how I'm feeling. The dog's acting up. It's a lot. It's a lot. I'm calling in um, back up today. And we are going to my granny's house where my aunt is. The OG, the OG aunt calling in reinforcements. At this point, I'm gonna just get her a little bell to shake at me. I feel like that would just save us both time. So we're gonna do the trampoline. We're gonna see fair can come we'll see what auntie want to do for lunch do you want anything specific for lunch do you know okay i'll let her know she probably already has but okay so when we get there you can let her know um you think you know what you want for lunch or we gonna see how we feel a little later Okay, so we can we can think about that and just see how we feel a little later. Cause it's still early. We got an early start today, girl. The Valentine's Day tree. Hmm. chaotic but my aunt is making chewies um can you explain what chewies are for people who are not from the low country it is a low country you know where's the other pumpkin is okay it's like a brownie but not that's like it's just like it says it's chewy but it's a pecan cake chewy She's supposed to teach me how to make it, but I haven't learned yet. And she still hasn't, and it's been 32 years, and I still haven't learned. So now we have to force her to make it, because nobody else knows how to. 
But I'm gonna learn this year. Okay. And this is my aunt, Devetta. No, I am not looking at AKA Velveeta. <laughs> Like. This is the original um, childless single rich auntie who taught me all my ways. And this is Farah. Farah, say hi to the vlog. I want the vlog. Okay. <laughs> you did better than Blue Girl. Blue be like, what? <laughs> yes, ma'am. Auntie's making some chewies for us. It's even better than cupcakes, girl. You never had them before. I know a rare sighting. Okay, excuse me. Don't worry, I have you cropped out of the scene. Oh, good. Okay. A rare sighting of the Chewies in action. My aunt, my my cousin Denisha is here as well. Say hi to the vlog. Hey. I told her I said she never makes these. This is a low country specialty that we never get. I know. And that. somehow we've guilted her into making them for us. <laughs> and apparently, I look, girl. Fair was made for the camera. She said hi, vlog. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> hi, vlog. Oh, now you say it hi to the vlog. Because normally Blue don't talk right, to the vlog. Get out of my kitchen. All right, out the kitchen, out the out kitchen. kitchen. You know, Thank you. you know the Bye. old blacks don't like us in their space. Right. Out my kitchen. Thank you. I'm going to eat some chewy. All right, that is the end of our Can Can Tater weekend. Until the vlog. Bye. Bye. That was perfect. Thank you, ma'am. Okay.